um, today I'm going to talk about on a fountain or a solar pump. Um, this kind of pump is usually is running on 12 uh, VDC. Okay, it's a 12 uh, VDC or 24 VDC kind of pump. Uh, and some of you can recall, this is the uh, brushless uh, 12 VDC pump that uh, Solar Power Mark or SC Origin or SCOMAC has been carrying uh, more than uh, five years already. And this can run on 12V or 24V. That means it can run on uh, uh, multiple currents, all right, uh, direct currents, okay? And a lot of customers are quite happy with this pump uh, because it's really, you use this to uh, create water features, uh, fountain, and you know, it can give you a uh, very good uh, pumping and it's also very easy to use. Uh, either is uh, you connect the end to a solar panel and uh, it will start pumping, yeah? Or you also can connect to a 12V battery bank or 24V battery bank uh, and you can run the pump for, uh, you know, 24 hours or even at night, okay? But of course, for us, uh, we never stop from there, uh, right? Because uh, we always believe uh, there will come to the time that customer may require a larger pump for a larger or bigger application, so right? So today, what I'm going to talk to you is about on our new pump. Uh, this pump, as you look at it, it, you know, it's quite huge, yeah? It's a very huge cycle of pump. Uh, the reason why it's huge is because we want to have a pump uh, it's a 12 VDC or 24 V pump, a direct current pump that is uh, huge and it can pump a very high rate. Okay, these guys uh, is consumed roughly about 25 watts, 20 to 25 watts, and uh, it can pump uh, maximum at uh, 2,500 liter per hour. 2,500 liter per hour. Okay. Uh, is like the predecessor, it's easy to use. Uh, all you have to do is actually uh, connect to a 30 watt uh, solar panel, okay, at the back end. You, can, you just need to connect to a 30 watt solar panel and it will just stop uh, pumping, okay. Uh, or you can connect to a 12V battery bank, uh, let's say you want to pump during the night, uh, or 24V uh, battery bank, uh, let's say you want to, you know, uh, pumping. Uh, using a uh, battery bank and as you can see this pump actually come with uh, outer casing okay the huge outer casing actually is designed uh, to protect it uh, from dirt or mud from cropping yeah so uh, that is why you can see the uh, different kind of uh, design of the uh, uh, outer casing okay and of course uh, this is where you can hold the pump if, if you want to lah, at the back all right uh, it's quite heavy and you can adjust the you know the head. Um, of course, here is where you you, you put in the holes or a pipe, yeah, standard uh, uh, diameter. And I want to talk about another feature of this pump is actually this is a dry run protection kind of pump. Okay, uh, let's say you are pumping something uh, in the fountain or in the river or things like that. You sometimes uh, the water or the river run dry, and you worry about the. Uh, the, the, the pump is damaged. Uh, this comes with a dry run protection. Yeah. Okay. Um, probably this is a very huge pump. I need to find a place that uh, you know a, a pond, a river that is huge enough uh, for me to test this pump, and maybe I can shoot some video for you guys to see to watch. Uh, but of course, uh, let me find a place first, and I'll probably will show you a, a video on uh, how this pump uh, in action. But of course, I, either I need to bring a uh, a solar panel or a battery bank to just to power this guy. Okay, and um, you can check out uh, more detail uh, of this pump in SCOMA, uh, S C O M A R T dot com, or at uh, Solar Power Mark. Okay, all right. Thank you. Okay, what I have right now is actually I'm hooking the, uh, the brushless pump uh, to a uh, 7.2 AH battery and connect it directly to the uh, 
pretty bump. All right. Uh, I do not bring a solar panel today. Is because uh, I uh, a bit doubt about the sun uh, condition. So uh, instead of hooking to a solar panel, uh, I hook it to the uh, uh, 7.2 AH battery. But of course, if you uh, hook it to a solar panel, the water uh, power output will be slightly bigger. Is because a solar panel. Uh, can produce up to 18 V. All right. Uh, for a 12 V battery, uh, basically you only can get around about 12 V, 12 to 13 V. So because of a bit low voltage, um, the water feature, you know, the height will be a bit uh, lower. But of course, uh, it's good enough to uh, demonstrate uh, how good the uh, you know the uh, uh, brushless uh, solar pump is. All right. highly promote a solar power uh, farm is because uh, this is a very green uh, technology and all you need is just the power from the sun you know you can create a very nice uh, water feature uh, for us all right so we encourage you uh, to use green energy such as the sun all right to power uh, the solar farm all right thank you for